guys, what's going on? Welcome back to a new video. Tech season is still here and it is absolutely crazier than ever, but I can't really complain. Well, I'm a little tired, but I'm not gonna complain because that just means that we are getting new, exciting tech. For today's video, we have the new DJI Action 2. Now I went ahead and unboxed this. There are two different versions. This is the version that has the dual screens. The other version has a dual battery, but we now have this new magnetic design, which makes this very compact, versatile, and honestly, this is the smallest action camera that can do 4K 120. So in the box we have the DJI Action 2, we have the front touchscreen module with the power cable, the magnetic lanyard, magnetic adapter mount, and the magnetic ball joint adapter mount. Now back in my travel and adventure days, I used the original Osmo Action for basically everything. It was such a fun little camera. And now we have this, and I haven't been traveling as much and I have been so busy where basically the highlight of my day is like walking my dog, which don't get me wrong, I love it, but I haven't been doing as many action-y things. And to get that real first person point of view, we have a necklace, which it just magnetically sticks, but you're not supposed to wear it this way. You hide it like this. So it also helps with stability. Not in my personal life of stability, but in the stability sense of the camera. One of the things that DJI does great is their stabilization. They have rock steady stabilization, but now they actually have horizon stabilization. So horizon stabilization is exactly that. It will understand horizons and it will keep it stable and level. This also does have water resistance up to 10 meters, but I also believe that with an accessory, you can also get a waterproof case to allow for more. So one of the best things about this is yes, it is modular and having this additional screen is super helpful if you are filming yourself. Say you're making like a little vlog. It does have internal storage, but it also has room for a micro SD card. But what I really like about this is it's great for travel, it's great for adventure, but it also can be great for getting these small, simple shots. I'm coming in for the pets. What's going on, little man? I missed you. I love you. Give me that bell. Give me that bell. What makes this really great is this little camera is something that I would just keep with me at all times. Throw it in my backpack, throw it in my pocket. It's so tiny and since it records audio, it's 4K, 4K 120. So the sun is setting, but I'm gonna take you guys outside and finish the rest of this video all shot on the action too. Oh man. It's been a minute since I've ridden this bike and actually it's been in storage for a long time and I haven't been here for a long time and the last time before I rode this there was like a whole crime incident where my bike got like stolen but like thrown down a flight of stairs and I just realized that my throttle is broken so this should be interesting this could be a very action-packed bike ride I hope it's not here is where the throttle is supposed to be See what happens. Famous last words. We are in the ultra wide mode right now. I should have checked it. Okay, my brakes work. Okay, good. Okay, here we go. Oh, geez. in the ultra wide this is now just the standard field of view i'm not gonna lie this bike is it's it's it has some issues like there are some noises there are some things the throttle is broken i think i need to get my bike fixed <laughs> but just being able to magnetically stick this to the bike to get different shots it's pretty cool i just don't know if i feel comfortable with one hand holding the camera as i am right now so I am very thankful that I can magnetically stick it on there because I gotta put my hand back. I'm scared. So I'm really enjoying this camera so far. I know this is still just like a quick little test of it until I can actually do something and have some time to make a great review but I am really enjoying it so far. And I love right now I have it attached so that I can have the front facing screen and I can see myself while I'm filming. Let's go get the sunset. Maybe we'll do a little time lapse and um, make our way back home. All 
All right, so this was just a very, very, very quick overview of the new DJI Action 2. I cannot wait to go on an adventure and test this out. There's a link in the description if you guys want to check out the product. Thank you to DJI for sending me this review unit. I promise you I will do some type of activity that is more adventurous than riding a bike. I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching.